There we go. Hey everybody. Uh, second close-up stream today, also not quite live. Um, sorry, I didn't mean to hit you. <laughs> you, can, you don't have to move. Um, I thought you guys deserved to see Fable and her little kids here, since we didn't get a chance to come in and show them on this morning stream. This is going to be a real short one, um, but uh, I did have a, just a tiny bit of news. Um, I've checked the kids again, and I'm convinced now they're all girls, which I kind of thought to start with, and now... I'm just gonna. I'm, that's. I'm gonna go down and say that they're all girls. Um, so, I've never been wrong before when I say what they are for sure. Let's uh, let's hope I'm not wrong this time either. I think we've got three little girls. So uh, let's just see if I can tell you who's who. Um, we have Ink, and you can tell Ink because she's a little darker and a little bigger than the others. So this is Ink. Hi, Ink. Oh, I know. Say hi though. Okay, that's Ink. Then we have her sister Quill, who's just a little smaller and a little lighter, but not much. They're they're twins, twinsies. So there's Quill, and then we have their sister Parchment, who's easy to tell because she's sort of a gray-colored tabby instead of being a dark one like they are. There you have it, all three little girls. Now. I haven't weighed them yet today. Uh, I'll weigh them later tonight around uh, 7 or 8, and uh, we'll see how they're doing. But they feel like they're all putting on exactly the right amount of weight, and we're happy about that. And their mom seems like she's doing really well, too. She's had bad poops since the day she arrived, but just today, she had good poops for the first time, and she seems like she's happy about it, too. So we're pretty happy about the health of these guys. I think they're doing really well. That's, um, I'm pretty sure that's all I have to talk about news-wise, but I'll let you guys watch them for just a couple more minutes. I think the video from, on these uploads might be a little better and closer than what you get on the regular Kitten Academy live stream. But do, when you're done watching this video, uh, feel free to keep on watching these kittens by tuning into the Kitten Academy live stream right here on YouTube. Oh, I know some people were speculating about whether their eyes were opening, but I think that's just kind of an illusion based on the fact that they've all got some dark eyeliner. I mean, it even looks like they're open to me now a little bit when I look at them, but they're not. I checked up close, and they're definitely not. And uh, time-wise, we wouldn't expect them to open for uh, another, like, five days or more. Uh, usually it happens right around ten days. There's exceptions, of course, but... So far, uh, it, the fact that these guys look like their eyes are starting to open, I promise you it's just an illusion. That's some good stuff, isn't it? Right. <clears throat> Thanks, everybody. <laughs> Say goodnight, Fable. <laughs> <laughs> 